I'm sitting on the ground in Dillingham, Alaska, and uh, you know the flight service station, uh, Alaska is kind of a dying breed, and they got one here at Dillingham, so I'm going to kind of walk you through uh, procedures for taking off at a flight service station. Uh, you contact 122.3 first, and I'll be doing that in a second. Um, tell them what you're calling from. Uh, or tell them that you're on 22.3. They're monitoring a bunch of different frequencies. Um, the flight service station here in Dillingham is in that building right over there. It's the uh, one on the far right. It's got a kind of a maroon, dark brown stripe on the top of it. They sit right in that top floor there. And uh, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to give them a call, tell them uh, to activate my flight plan, which I've already made through Kenai Flight Service this morning about 4.35 o'clock in the morning. So they have it on their computer. They're a activated uh, on 122.3. Then I'll turn back to 123.6, um, talk to them again, tell them that I have the ATIS and where I'm headed, and all the traffic will hear me, and I'll uh, taxi on out. Okay, here we go. I think we're going to get Janice there. She's working there this morning in the flight service station. Yeah, Dillingham Radio, it's Cherokee 81809. I uh, should have a flight plan in there for uh, Equoc, over the parks and back, three hours on the computer. Could you activate that for me, please? to get back to us. Charlie 18557. Yeah, good morning. Uh, thank you. And Dillingham Radio, Cherokee 809, taxiing with Bravo on Northeast Bound.